I'm Melinda Elmer with Century 21 Masters, and today I'm here to talk about what is escrow. Hi, I'm Melinda Elmer with Century 21 Masters, and thank you so much for watching my video blog today. I'm here with Alicia Smith from Premier Services, and we're going to talk a little bit about what is escrow. Take it away. <laughs> escrow is a mutual third party who works on behalf of all parties in the transaction. So we work with the seller, the buyer, the agent, the bank or the buyer who's lending them the funds, and we provide all the paperwork and collect all the funds so that we make sure everybody is doing their part and doing it according to the regulations and the rules of the transaction. Awesome. So we have an escrow company, obviously, and we also often use it as a time frame. Say we open escrow, we're opening the escrow with a company, but we also refer to it kind of as a, the time frame from when you start the transaction to when you close. Correct. When we open escrow, then we begin the process so that we can get to the closing. And what does an escrow officer do specifically? Well, we handle all the paperwork, as I stated earlier. We handle the funds. We contact and the clients, and we contact the agents. So we act as a liaison between everybody with communication and with documentation. And what is the extent of that communication back and forth between both buyers and sellers? It's quite extensive. We're talking often, we're updating often. We are um, letting them know what we need so that we can get the transaction closed and letting them know what we already have and if we were closing as scheduled. Excellent. Now, what would you, how does an escrow company protect the interest of their clients? Their interest is protected, first of all, the buyer is protected in the fact that their funds are in a trust account, which is regulated, so their funds are not going anywhere and they are simply held for the transaction. Same for the seller. The seller is protected because we are handling all funds and making sure it gets to their destinations whether it's their account at the close or it's their mortgage company being paid off and making sure that title completes that. So it's very important to have a third party who does not have an interest with anybody specifically to act on everybody's behalf. And that's what escrow does. And pretty much anything that you do has to be directed to you in writing. Exactly. There is no, no verbal instruction allowed to be taken. ESCO works solely on written instructions and agreed upon by all parties. Perfect. Well, thank you so much for coming in to tell us a little bit more about what ESCO is and then solve that mystery. If you have any other questions, feel free to reach out to either one of us. Alicia, can you reach that? 949-383-5527. Or you can also reach out to myself, Melinda, at 562-316. 2915. Thank you so much for your future and present referrals. And if you know of anybody else who needs my help or wants to get more information about this or anything real estate related, let me know. Feel free to click on the links below to get more information about your current home's value or see what properties are out there. And I can also be reached at melinda at the elmerteam.com. Thanks so much for watching.